Welcome to my studio. This is Chris Dahlquist from Kansas City, Missouri, and I would love to show you around. This front part of my studio is uh, serves as both a gallery for folks that uh, want to come see work um, and a clean space for my office. Um, we love to have people at our studio because we're able to uh, really uh, show them more work than we're able to in my booth. You know, in my booth, you might be familiar with this work, which is the Mile Marker series, which are these really spare landscapes that I'm printing on gold painted steel. Uh, but this is just a fraction of what uh, I create here in the studio. I also have another series called Ghost Notes. Again, really soft, quiet landscapes, but this time printing them on a Japanese rice paper and then waxing it uh, to make it a little more translucent so that you can see that it is uh, suspended over another print that's below it. Mile markers. So the mile markers change all day long as the lighting on them changes and they change as you move about the room. Seem to have dimension or be alive. Here's some more ghost notes work, which is the work that is on the rice paper. Uh, I took the name ghost notes from a word used in music. A uh, ghost note is a note that is played but not meant to be heard. It's played to amplify everything else around it. This wall represents uh, the work that I've made, or the series that I've made over the last 20 years, starting with this aluminum work and the copper work, moving on to the mile markers. Always combining my images with different materials to further the story of the photograph. In addition to this wall work, I also do some public artwork. Uh, here's an example of a project that I did uh, recently in Kansas City, and I'm hoping to do it uh, in another community real soon. It's called the History Vendors. It's a vintage vending machine uh, that I used in a park in Kansas City along with a couple other machines to vend historic photographs of the surrounding area. Uh, I paired those with a map so that participants could find their way to where their original photo was taken. And then I'm really excited to share with you uh, one of my new series, a piece from my new series. This new series is called Measuring Abundance. Again, these really quiet, really meditative spaces. Um, this one I'm printing on a uh, polyester film that is translucent and then suspending it over another print. I'm not sure in the video that you can really tell, but there's handwork and a grid happening on the print below. Um, when you see them in person, it's hard to tell what's happening uh, on what surface. Again, it changes as you move around, uh, changes as the light strikes it differently. Some more mile markers. Let me show you to the back of the studio where we actually make the work. All right, welcome to the part of the studio where the work actually happens. Most everything happens on this great big table. You can see all the layers of gold paint on it. Uh, right now it is set up for Kyle to frame three pieces that are heading to someone's, uh, someone's office space. Um, the mile marker series takes about six to eight weeks to dry from the time I create it uh, to when we can begin to trim it and prepare it for framing. So all these pieces are just hanging out, uh, waiting for their turn to be framed. Um, all of this is the framing supplies and paper supplies for different bodies of work. Now all of these racks are pieces that are drying, uh, waiting their turn to be framed. just one after another. So 
So all of them are dated. This was printed on 227. And then behind these racks, uh, these roll out of the way because we're kind of short on space. These roll out of the way um, across the room and behind it is our mat cutter and our glass cutter. Uh, we tend to work uh, one series of work at a time because we're a little short on space. Uh, incidentally, we were just working on construction for a new studio. Um, it's getting put on hold a little bit till we see what the climate's gonna be moving forward. But anyway, welcome to this studio space. Uh, maybe before too long, we'll have another one to show you. Thanks for coming along on this tour with me. I'd love to share a few more finished pieces with you. And then I hope to meet you over at my website, chrisdolquist.com. Thanks for joining me. Bye-bye.